Okay, so inspired by Sheila Nadinda, I have decided to make a fenugreek seed hair spritz because she has a, well, I feel that she has a similar hair texture and hair density and hair issues. She made a fenugreek seed hair spritz a while back and I messaged her on Instagram and surprisingly she actually responded because she has quite a big following. So I was surprised that she responded, but she did say that it was working well for her and she did notice a difference. So. I picked these up on Amazon. I believe I got them both for about $10 total. So I've got two cups of hot water. I boiled it, but it's not actually boiling. It's been sitting for a while. And I'm just gonna add about two to three tablespoons of the fenugreek seeds to it, and then let it sit for at least 24 hours. And the purpose, of course, fenugreek seed is good for hair loss, hair shedding, promotes growth and shine. Okay, it's the next day and this is about 30 hours later. This is my fenugreek spritz. I don't know if you can tell, but the water's kind of green. It's taking on like a, whoops, sorry. It's taking on like a green hue. So right now all I'm gonna do is strain it and then pour it into this spray bottle. I picked this up from my local dollar store. It was actually $4, which is incredibly overpriced for a dollar store, but um, it's good quality and it's more like an atomizer as opposed to a regular spray bottle. So it's more of like a fine mist, which is what I wanted. And plus it's kind of a cool looking bottle. I don't know, I like it. And that's it, you guys. I've seen a lot of recipes online where people add a ton of stuff to their fenugreek spritz um castor oil coconut oil all kinds of oils rose water neem etc but i've decided just to do the fenugreek because if you add too much stuff you're not going to know what's making the difference and i figure if i use this and it works then i know the fenugreek is doing something if it doesn't work then there's no point adding additional ingredients to something that's not working anyways right so i'm going to keep mine simple I'm basically gonna use this as my daily moisturizing mist in place of plain water. So, you know, every day or every other day, whenever I feel the need to spritz my hair, I'm just gonna replace my plain water with this and see if I notice a difference in like the shedding or thickness and stuff like that. And I'll keep you guys posted on my thoughts, probably in my next talk and twist. I just tested it and I had to come back and show you guys. It's so weird how this little spray bottle works. So like you just pump it. Look, can you guys? I'm wasting it. It's just like a steady mist. That is so cool. No wonder it was so expensive. Just FYI, it smells like maple syrup. I forgot to tell you that. <laughs>